Hello again. This is Vildra. I am back and I've been thinking about this uh, creating a save file thing again. I started over with um, Willow Creek and base game builds, uh, but ignoring the style and just making houses that I thought was nice. But then I watched a video with Sachan Sims who talked about important things to think about when building a world save. And one of the things he said was, when you do build a save file, <laughs> it's important to know that you're making it for yourself. So having stuff that is very downloadable from the gallery, that's fine. And I do like having stuff on the gallery that other people can use. And I find it gratifying when someone wants to download something I've built. But for myself, if I was going to build the world for my own gameplay, I wouldn't want to restrict myself when it comes to packs. So I decided to uh, start another save. <laughs> I will continue with the, the Willow Creek one that I've started uh, with base game only. But I want to make a save file that I can use for all my future gameplays and with the um, stuff that I need and things that I lack a lot is good community lots and restaurants. And with a hundred baby challenge, uh, I need woohoo spots in every possible community uh, lot. And I also thought I don't want to start in Willow Creek always. I want to build wherever inspiration takes me. And one of my absolute favorite worlds is Brindleton Bay, which is also where my a hundred baby challenge household is. And Windenburg is another place I really want to build in. And I looked at this. These community lots aren't that fun. This lounge, Club Calico, it's totally not fun. I really need to redo that totally. Maybe I'll made, make a rec center of some sort here instead. Because I, I never go here. I've added, I think I've added a woohoo spot so I can use it in my 100 baby challenge. But and uh and I did redo this uh, saloon, but also not fun and not cute. And then I found this this little ugly house, which is a cat hangout and a, a person with a lot of cats and one dog living here. I'm going to evict them. I'm going to want to put in some townies as well. Yep. Goodbye. Uh, now I'm going to go here. I, I, I want to make a small restaurant here or a cafe, maybe a cafe. Because I looked at the, at the houses across the street. Look at these. This kind of seems to fit with, with the bistro pack. And look, and these are nice sort of uh, townhousey brick uh, thingies. I think it would be nice to have one of the, even if this is on the docks, it could sort of go with this kind of style, at least a little. Does it have to be all wood and rustic just because it's on the docks here? I'm not sure. So I'm going to try to build something in sort of this style. And if it turns out it doesn't fit here at all, well, I can, um, I can place it somewhere else in the world. This is uh, partly a brick. Uh, let's just bulldoze it. Any possible terrain paint can go as well. Yeah, can we have light? This this save file is based on my uh, uh, gaming family save, which I did on purpose. Uh, there's a lot of stuff I've built and downloaded that is in here that may not stay. But uh, the reason I chose that one is because on this save file, I have done the Stranger Will story. And... Uh, in, in a well save, I think uh, it feels important to have that thing done so we can just actually live in the world without having uh, people being possessed and whatnot. And if you should like to have possessed people, you can always eat the fruit. But um, we're going to build here. So far, I've done restaurants and uh, cafes and uh, retail stores. 
I've made them with a sort of empty apartment on top. So if you want to do a gameplay with a build like that, you can actually live on the lot. And if you want to run a cafe or a restaurant, I'm going to slam together a shell and we'll see. I think I'll cut that out. I'm going to change the lot rate. Cafe, is that what I want? What do you need? I wish there were multi-purpose lots so I could have a cafe, a working cafe downstairs and apartments on top. Maybe we'll make it a cafe. So what do we need? Let's put out the stuff we need. I could just make a bar. I have to have an espresso bar. That's how it is, is it? So this doesn't count. What if I make it a bar instead? Okay, I only need four dining chairs and two tables, but um, we can have more. So the, these are the requirements. I think I'll go with the doors and windows from the, from the bistro thing. I want some more shape to this. Not sure what colors to use yet, but um, we'll see. So in the back here, we could have bathrooms. What is the woohoo spot going to be? Maybe a closet. Can you woohoo in one of these? It's the fashionista. I'll do that then because I don't want to take any chances. This one. I think this one will be good. We only need two toilets. These are kind of uh, the style I'm going for. Towel dispenser. Let's, uh, let's um, put that here. And let's have a bin underneath. Would it look awkward with that? Because if, if you want to put this up, you kind of need taller walls. I don't know. Can we have light? Okay, we want this one. And maybe a couple of these. I think that looks nice. And then the actual bar. I would like to have some sort of a small stage. So this is the basics. We, uh, requirements are filled now. Now I can put in whatever I want. TV. Don't know where. How is that? Maybe this is what we have to choose from. Maybe that is the least obnoxious. Hmm. Across the street, it's white and gray, and there it's sort of green. What options do we have? Pink. Oh my gosh, we could make a pink bar. Light blue? Is that interesting, or is it totally awful? Brindleton Bay, though, and on the docks. I don't think I hate it. Uh, you? What do you come in? Oh my... I wish only the fabric had been. Do I hate that? Let's look at the other kit because I think there were umbrella tables. You come in a matching blue. Wow. I see. And the chairs from this pack. They too come. I actually don't hate it. It's normally not a color I would pick, but might have to change the color of everything later. So we need some sort of flooring. We don't want dirt. 
and the grass would feel wrong. Is that totally awful? Or in grey? Maybe this. I don't hate that. How blue will this be? Very. I think maybe I'll hate it. But everything can't be blue, then I'll go crazy, I think. Or maybe I'll go all in blue. Why not? I mean, you might as well commit. Can we do something about the walls? It's a blue hell. Didn't I make another blue hell recently? Oh, and the lovely lacy curtains. No, that's not a useful height. You need to be there. The point is to block the view. So these cafe curtains are supposed to be in this height. To stop passers-by from looking in. And you don't work. You don't work on the diagonals. Well, we'll skip them there then. That's how it's supposed to be, I think. These are lovely. And then there are these lovely lights. We can put them over the tables for now. One over here. Maybe we should have a spotlight or something there. We have these. Not over the door, perhaps. So where is it dark? It's dark over here. I mean, it, it's a bar. It doesn't have to be really well lit up. We'll do this flooring in here as well. I think we'll do also... Oh. No, we don't need that wall. No, we can uh, just... Just for... Uh, sake of it. I'm not sure this door fits. Or maybe something more like this. I think that will do. I would like a microphone. Go there. And I think we'll have a bar stool and a guitar. Kind of like that. Maybe like that. What do we have in here? We need mirrors. Maybe these. What color was it? That one. Want a bin in there? Maybe one of these. And a toilet paper. Uh, 
Um, let's not do these lamps. Let's do uh, these. And let's have doors. It's useful to have doors. It is as it is. Uh, we need plants. Can we slide this door over? Can I shrink it? I can. I don't hate it, really. Right, can we have a uh, uh, daylight? Now we need lots of little fencing off and whatnot. And we need a wallpaper. And we need, <laughs> we need a roof and a second floor. That has a funny thing in the corner. And that one too. Is that what we want? That's kind of funny. Sort of takes care of the roofing issue. Lately, I've become very fond of this flooring. Don't know why, especially the light one. I think there should be stairs from the outside in the back going up here. Maybe the opposite direction. Uh, why is... Oh. That is annoying. Can I move it one step out? Can I sort of build a... Uh, Landing. Uh, maybe. Maybe pull it out one. Okay, can we move you for a bit? Hello? Ah, oh, I see. Okay, let's move the lot forward a bit. No, I wanted to extend it, that's why. It's a pity you can't put the stairs in the middle there. Oh, ceiling. I forgot ceiling. That is almost the same as the freeze. I can live with it. We need we need wallpaper. And I would like something. How do these houses look? They're brick. I need a floor trim there. Defo, just to cover up the nasty. Does it stick out a lot? It sticks out too much. Mm. 
No, I did it again. Oh, my God. Let's save again. Okay, let's change the door. Can we do this one? And we can lower the wall height here as well. Do I care for this? Uh, let's put some windows in and see how it goes. They need to be white. Let's look at city living. They have those and those. Difference between this and this. I'll just put on a blank wallpaper, maybe paint the walls white. Maybe I'll make a floor plan. This is good because it gives you an entryway. It looks a bit weird. I am, I am aware, but uh, so how could we arrange this? So this is the kids room. This is the main bedroom. How about I would want a balcony outside. We will, we will have to have columns below here. No, we, no, we need a door there. Maybe one of those. And we could actually do half wall. Maybe. Okay, now we need to look into the columns again. That's good enough. What about if we, I haven't done this in ages, but maybe a little uh, grid. Uh, that was very... Can I do it tighter? I can't. Hmm.
Uh, what's with these jagged edges? Does that look absolutely awful? Kind of. But also kind of nice. I'm not sure about this brick color. Maybe it should be the lighter one. And why is that window glitched? Yeah, I think, I think. I haven't done any landscaping, seriously. Okay, so I decided to change to white and uh, also white and use the bistro chairs. I still have it blue on the inside though, but I thought, felt, uh, Enough might be enough. I think, um, I think we'll go this color with the curtains as well. Can we make this normal size again? I think I want to have it sort of covering where we cannot have curtains. Don't need curtains there because people's people aren't gonna sit there. But um, uh, and I'm not sure what color to use here. Maybe the blue and white. I like this a lot better. But now I want to go to debug. <laughs> I, oh, here it is. God dang it! I think I'm gonna have a few. Flower boxes is my next question. Is that something we would like? I also had this kind of fencing. Which I don't absolutely hate. Well, there are these, which I don't hate. Well, these are also nice. I think it's these across the street. Yep. Okay, we have those to play around with. I'm going to put these things around there for now. I don't think we'll be using that tree. That is similar to the one we've got. It's that debug, I wonder. Probably not. But I think it's uh, more in color with that one. The question is, is it too big? I think it's kind of nice though, because it gives shade and it does, it's not in, in the face of the people sitting there. We're going to have it in all corners. Is that how it is?
I don't absolutely hate it. I would like some planting stuff. Maybe something here. And maybe something here. I kind of like these ones. I don't think I've used them before. Cottage living. I don't know if that's too much. I don't know if I should have windows here. Maybe. Oh, we have these, my favorites. Oh, this this isn't the bug. I do love these. Maybe there can be some stuff on the back side where it's pretty dead. Some ivy, maybe. Where is this from? Vampires. It's a pretty good ivy. I think we'll have some in this corner. Isn't there the one from... Is it the university? The one, the corner one? Maybe that colour is better. I don't know. Too tall. Are you in the middle? You're even taller. You could go down. Could we put something on it? Does that work? Can you put stuff? Yes. Can you put these? You can. Uh, let's remove the ivy. Can you sort of stack these here? Hello? I kind of like that. And maybe a little ivy on the top. Or not. I'll do one more of those. Okay. Not hating it. I, I just have a feeling these would work here with the other white flowers. I uh, go always go overboard with these things. We'll see. Is it? 
Hmm. I just felt it was really dead from behind. Well, it still is. We could do more here. But what I'm looking for is plant, sort of planters. Is this something we would like in the back? Sort of fence off uh, the docks. Since it's sort of a private property upstairs. The, these aren't bad, and these. I could work with those. I would like to have something here. And I would also like to have something here. I would like a longer one. What's this? This is also not totally hopeless. Can I have two? The good thing with um, the better build my is that you can you can eye drop debug items. I think we'll skip you. And we can put some plants in there because these are the windows without curtains. So I would like to have plants in them. Probably I should have a bit higher plants then. These come in so many lovely colors. I'll just put them in and we'll see about the colors. It can be different colors, perhaps. How does that look? Is it too colorful? Yellow. Maybe yellow. Does this come in yellow? It does. Those are, have yellow centers. Maybe that's good. I never go for yellow. Never. But maybe, I usually don't like yellow flowers at all, but these were really nice. I like that they're mixed, yellow and white. It doesn't get overwhelming as in a way that it does if it's only one color. Is it too much? I'm kind of a sucker for flowers, so I don't think it is. The trees may be too many though. Maybe there should only be two. There could be something here. Let's go uh, dive back into debug. Or maybe one of these in a box. Could it be in one of these? I have a feeling you would want to Cut off the dock if you're going to live upstairs. Is it weird with a tree in a pot? Since there's no grass, I feel there's a need of a lot of greenery. Maybe these are too much. I don't know. I think we need more ivy. It's a tad big. Uh, uh, that is a bit weird, but it's not bad. I wonder if I can shrink it. 
Well, I can, but if it will look good. I think that's better. I just want to put some plants out here because uh, it's on the outside. I'm not going to do anything on the interior. Can we first uh, get a couple of planters? Maybe blue. And some flowers. These also come in lovely colours. Maybe they can be different but matching. Okay, that's fine. And maybe a chair of some sort. A lounge chair perhaps. Oh, isn't that cute? That was cute. I haven't seen it in pink. Oh my gosh. And some um, outdoor lighting. We want that. There's this one. How do you look in pink? You look kind of adorable. You look awful. And you have white legs on the tables. So there's pink and yellow. I think this is uh, too much. But maybe some outdoor lighting. Uh, well, maybe this. How does it look at night? Because we want some lighting on the house. Uh, it feels like it's missing now. String lights. Well, these are cute. City living. I think you can go away. I, okay. Does this stick into the house? I would like an empty pole then. Is there one? There isn't. What do you do then? You make a double one? You make a double one. Is that nice? kind of looks cute but well, I don't hate it I think I think uh, you can go away and I think we can have uh, you also here can we have mailbox trash chute. There's a big difference between a trash chute and a mailbox. It's these ones that I'm not sure about. I'd like to put in a bike. How about this cute one? This one. In blue, maybe? more green. Let's make it a yellow one. The question is, should there be more vines here? I think maybe there should.
I don't want to do more, I think. The question is this. I think maybe they're too much. But I kind of kind of like the, the... Let's put them back. Maybe this one should be there, but not this one's. Or maybe they should be here instead. And adjust the lights. Well, actually, they're quite centered now. Maybe like that. Maybe that sort of closes off the the bar area. Maybe we should put a dumpster there. An extra woohoo spot. Is there is there any dumpster that isn't absolutely dirty? Yeah. And we have two woohoo spots. One last look at the interior. It feels uh, better now that everything isn't blue. I think I might even change these chairs to white. And we'll just have the bar, the tablecloths. And the back bar thing. We have the wallpaper as well, so there is plenty, plenty of blue. Yeah, that's better. Maybe you should be normal size. Maybe you shouldn't be here at all. Because uh, you block the woohoo spot. But maybe there should be a few more things on the shelves. There's that little, little plant from the flower kit thingy. What's this? No. This one, that can be there. And maybe some boxes or tins or... You always need lemons in a bar, don't you? Glasses would be nice. I I'm not sure there is any. Cow plant. I mean, something more like that. I don't want to clutter too much because uh, it's a bar. But just so it doesn't look empty. Maybe they also serve tea. You can have more bottles. I think that's fine. And then there was these little things, these little menus in the kit. That'd be cute. These ones. I think I'll, I'll take these out and put in those instead. Maybe also outdoors.
Maybe not pink in here. Do those. Hmm. Yeah. I'll put in some tiles there. Because it's a bathroom. This could be an office if you want a one bedroom apartment on top. Kitchen, living room, master bedroom. I think I'm finally happy with this. A beautiful sunset. What are we going to call it then? There is a bar there. I'm going to change that to a restaurant, I think. Can we put lot traits? We want a romantic aura. Well, we want great acoustics because uh, uh, there's going to be a musician. Social event goals becomes much easier. Well, that's good if you're going to date. I think I'll do those. I mean, I'm going to need so many dating places <laughs> once uh, the new expansion comes out, which is soon. So this is this is a bar with two woohoo spots in Brindleton Bay. And I don't think it stands out too much against all the other houses here. And you could use it to live in. I'm kind of happy with it. It changed quite a bit from when I started out. That's how it is. That's how it should be. The romantic dockside bar. Is there no light in here? Is it in the wall? I think it might be in the wall. There's a weird light in here and uh, there's no ceiling. No. Why is there weird light there? Doesn't it have a ceiling? No, it does. But can we paint it? Why is, is there no wall here? I don't get it. Uh, we want a ceiling, a nice one. I want this. And upstairs. Maybe this. Can be changed, but at least there is one. Let me go uh, first person in here. Is there too much yellow in the ceiling? I think it kind of fits. But look, the ceiling, the mirror. Okay. I think it looks kind of nice. We need to fix that light. That TV and the mirror. Uh, so the truth is, this mirror is too tall. Can I shrink it? You can't shrink a mirror, can you? No, you can't. Because the glass doesn't shrink. We're going to have to skip that mirror. Then we can put this TV here instead. Which... I don't want anyone to watch, but it's a requirement, so they're going to watch it. Maybe we should have this light over here instead.
that's better. A good thing I looked. I think it's good enough. Uh, the only thing I'm uh, hesitant about is the pink over here, but uh, it is as it is now. I'm not going to change it. I would want more of these. Do want more of them. I have all that side. Maybe I should have on this side as well. I kind of like an overflow of uh, those. That's uh, that's how it is, and this is my world. <laughs> Not sure we need any here, do we? Hello. If so, we need to have two. No, let's we'll skip that. This is a bit over the top. But I'm going to let it be. Maybe, maybe we should add some here. Clips. I like mixing them. Uh, Okay, and maybe we'll put the bin in the gap there. There you go. More green. Is this the same color? It's not. Last minute discovery. I'm happy with this brick and I'm happy with the white. I'm glad I took out the blue. Okay, I'm saving it. Not optimal pictures, I have to say. Well, let's shoot it out there. Let's see how it turned out. Well, this is it, the romantic dock sidebar. And it's placed on the, the crazy catwoman's lot in Brindleton Bay. Uh, if I don't know if she's an original uh, resident there, but it's a bar. You'll find it on the gallery. My ID is Bildra, if you want to look for it. I think I'm going to place this also in my 100 baby save because uh, there's 
it's uh, such a sad lack of places to go for dates to meet people and with <laughs> i haven't uh, i haven't played it in a long time because since growing together came uh, i got the dread of well the infant dread but now love struck is coming and that is a good that must be a really good pack to play 100 babies in so I, I'm I'm getting back to it. I only have I think I have 65 babies so far. So I only have 35 to go. I will make it. And also in my hundred baby save, I live in Brindleton Bay. So uh, I'm I'm focusing right now on putting nice stuff in Brindleton Bay. <laughs> so I have places to go to meet people. But I also want to. Uh, in this world, when I rebuild it, I also want to fill houses with nice sims. Uh, because uh, uh, in all my saves, I uh, I kind of want to meet people uh, in, in the gaming save. They need to get married. They have kids. They get married. It's generations. And I don't want to make all their spouses. And I don't constantly marry townies. And I play with aging off there. So the town is never change. But I think I will be downloading Sims and households from the gallery because Cass is not my strongest suit. I prefer building. <laughs> but this build, I think, is finished now. I'm going to have my Sim visit. My Sim is here. I was going to build something here, but uh, I haven't decided on what yet. Let's see. Travel. Let's see if there's anyone there. I just want to see if uh, there will be people there. Oh, look, there's a bartender. There's someone there. Um, Brent, you can introduce yourself. She's angry. She's come all the way from Tomorani. Dargo. So so. So, so. <laughs> look, so, so. look, the bar is working. <laughs> Can you turn that off? Bruhana <laughs> Uh -huh. Oh my, fancy outfit. Oh, he are, uh, he are, uh, Can you please? Oh, <laughs> bloody daddy's working here. No? But look, no people here. <laughs> you know what? In the new, uh, when the new, oh my gosh. <laughs> when the new uh, expansion comes out, gosh, you're loud. When the new expansion comes out, I could change uh, uh, the venue to being uh, a singles bar, a singles hangout. I think there's a new lot type. Then it would be even better. Oh my gosh, so many people. <laughs> And the werewolf is in the corner. <laughs> I'm really happy to see that it works. And my poor self sim there is, uh, I'm not sure she's happy. <laughs> and people are moving around here. I think that is awesome. Can I lock this door? No, I can't because I don't own it. Well, it, se it seems to be a lively place. <laughs> People are running there. I'll uh, consider this a success. <laughs> I think I will focus kind of hard on Brindleton Bay because it's one of my favorite worlds to live in. I think this will be my next project and I want to make it a really nice restaurant. I don't know, does it need to be this rustic just because it's on the docks? I feel this this sort of 
It doesn't clash. I, I like it. <laughs> there will be more in this style, I think. But that will be it for this one. I will link uh, the gallery post in the description. And my ID is Vildra if you want to find it on the gallery. But this will be it for this one. Thank you for watching. Uh, I hope it's not five hours after I edit. <laughs> I will see you in the next one. Bye!